for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. The Android team is introducing App Search in Jetpack, now available in Alpha. App Search is an on-device search library which provides high performance and feature-rich full-text search functionality. With App Search, your application can offer offline search capabilities, have lower latency for indexing and querying over larger data sets compared to SQL Lite, provide relevant search results, and more. Learn about how to use App Search in your apps in the post. We're releasing the second beta of Android 12 for you to try. Beta 2 includes several of the new privacy features we talked about at Google I.O., as well as various feature updates to improve functionality, stability, and performance, including privacy dashboard, mic and cam indicators, mic and cam toggles, and more. Try today on your Pixel device and learn more about the beta release in the post. As developers, it's our responsibility to help keep our users safe online and protect their data. That's why we're open sourcing a first-of-its-kind general-purpose transpiler for fully homomorphic encryption, or FHE for short. This will enable developers to compute on encrypted data without being able to access any personally identifiable information. We still have a ways to go before most computations happen with FHE, but this is an important step towards bringing users helpful products that preserve their privacy and keep their data safe. Check out the post for a deeper look at the technology behind FHE and a link to the GitHub repo. Kubernetes networking almost always starts with a DNS request. That's why we're excited to announce the native integration of Cloud DNS with Google Kubernetes Engine to provide in-cluster service DNS resolution with Cloud DNS. Between global service discovery, local DNS resolution on every node, and integration with Google Cloud's operation suite and observability, container-native Cloud DNS vastly improves the operator experience while greatly improving application performance. Head to the post to give it a try. We're adjusting the Chrome OS release schedule to a four-week staple channel starting with M96 in Q4. For enterprise and education users, Chrome OS will also introduce a new channel with a six-month update cadence by M96. More details to be announced soon. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'm Megan for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.